Hi, Robert Crumb, the proud owner of the housing hub at Charles Ruthenberg Realty. I am going to have a full day class where you have full knowledge of how to purchase off the auction. Also, learn how to do title searches from Independence Title Services. Now, title insurance, what do we do? So when we round the title on this property, what is it? Adams Street? Yes. 636. Yeah. <coughs> when we round the property, three things came up. I'm not dealing with code, I'm not dealing with permit. Permits are not covered by title insurance. Code matters could potentially affect title insurance. They signed a whole harmless to that because they did their due diligence, not because they just forgot about it. They did their due diligence, signed a hold harmless with us. We're just insuring title and pulling all the players together, balancing the in and out of money, and we're charging our fees for doing that. Plus, the concierge fees that are that we don't charge for because this is a new thing we're helping everyone create, and we want to be part of it. <coughs> On title, there was the foreclosure claim, and there was an open mortgage, meaning that the foreclosed mortgage was clean, one lien for $544 for like water or something, and an open mortgage. With all of that said and their due diligence, they still move forward and purchase the property. They took into consideration in the beginning and in the middle and any changes, how much that open mortgage could be. Could it have been a missatisfaction that was never recorded and no balance? <coughs> Could it be a balance? God bless you. Could it be a balance that's open that they have to pay off and yet still make a profit? Well, ding, 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 the ladder came up. They purchased the property, did their research, have a balance of another mortgage, and with that balance, with the closing costs, with the carrying costs, with the improvement costs, everybody is still going to make quite a bit of money when this sells. Was there a risk? Yes. Did they try to minimize and educate the risk as much as possible? Yes. And so far, until he sells it, we have no issues right now, right? Nope. Everything's being worked out in payment, and he's fixing the price up. When do you think the property will be ready? You guys are going to see that property tomorrow. Oh, no, I've I mean, never seen the property. Yeah. So we're like 70 percent is somewhere around there we've done the painting inside outside we're laying towel right now okay. uh, so you guys will see that we're exactly where we're at come tomorrow so regardless of the number that they're going to make because don't please don't walk away with your from here saying oh, 50 is my first deal i'm begging you i am the more conservative as much as i may be out there personality wise i am very conservative because it ain't my money. And I have to answer to him, right? So it's not my money, I don't want to hear about it. I don't want to hear about, oh Lord, what happened? Where is the relationship? I don't want to hear it. So I don't focus on the entire success of the number. I focus on the success of the potential program for others, and is our lender going to get what he needs from it with, with the good teamwork and kind people? And as our investor, who's going to make the flip, are they safe and going to get their money out of it? Is Rob going to get his money out of it? All of you going to join the program and talk to Peter and talk to Rob and do this too and be safe? Because the caveat here is we're doing title work. Y'all are investing your time, <coughs> money, and energy. Does every investment make money? No. Is it guaranteed anywhere that you're going to make money on every investment? 